Welcome back to Light Work. So I hope that you're having a blessed and positive day. Let's get some messages and see what your guys want you to know. guys want you to know that as you continue to go through this ascension process okay there's somebody that's lurking in the background this person is trying to be unsuspecting with loud in the reverse this person is secretly learning from you although they'll never admit it and they are also projecting negative energy onto you this person uh may be trying to come off as someone that is from your soul tribe However, this person is not from your soul tribe. Your guides are about to extract this person from your energy or remove this person from your space. Okay. 111, this is there's a new start coming for you. Something is about to happen. Okay. You're being guided to release this person from your energy with love. Okay, once you are aware of what this person is trying to do and who this person is, your guides are saying, do not engage, do not argue, do not fight with this person, release this person with love and cleanse your energy. Let's see what else. What else should we be aware of concerning this false soul tribe person? friendship okay yeah this person is coming off like a friend trying to be a part of your soul tribe yeah they're trying to i'm seeing someone acting like you trying to do the same thing show the same interest okay the origin is about where you come from so a soul tribe member would be uh, a like energy a divine being this person is trying to come off they feel as though you are lucky okay this person knows that you are very loving kind and caring okay i'm hearing false person okay so be very careful about your the people that you are entertaining the people that you are allowing in your space at this time and be sure that you are cleansing your energy let's see what's on the bottom yeah alliance this person is really trying Okay, and I'm, I'm seeing somebody that's very convincing, someone that smiles quite a bit. This person appears to have good energy, but their energy is honestly really dark. Show us that, yeah, compromise. Okay, this is the energy of them wanting you to include them. I see someone trying to force their way into situation. This person feels left out. They want to be a part. This person has been guided by your guys to stop. Okay. What else? The lions again. This person is trying to forge the with bully, compromise and alliance. They're trying to force you to allow them in to connect with them for, for you to have this partnership to a cup's energy. What's the outcome? Pride. Ego. This person is really in their ego. They're going to try to force. They're going to try to continue to force their way because they don't want to be left out. They're trying to steal. <laughs> to steal, steal a spot in your soul tribe. This is very interesting. Okay. Your guides are saying this person is going to be sorry. We saw extraction. Okay. This person does not have your best interest. They're telling me to split it. Yeah. This person is really trying to connect with you to stress you out. This person wants 
to take your spot. This person wants to live your life. This person wants to be you, okay? Wanting you to be in this stressed out energy so that you will withdraw and they can potentially take your spot. Who is this person? Who is this person? Introvert. Again, we have loud in the reverse. This person is not speaking out about, they're not being loud. They're not being, uh, drawing attention to themselves. They're doing a lot behind the scenes. That may give you some type of idea. Yeah, look at this. This person is doing some type of magic in your dream state, okay? Let's get some tarot. Let's see what else we can get from about this person. You could work with this person. Okay, this person is very quiet. This person is keeping this hidden. This is not someone you would suspect would be operating in this energy. This person is an introvert, we saw. They stay in a lot. This person is not loud. It's in the reverse. This person is sitting back with the hangman plotting, okay? Bottom of the deck, we have the temperance. Okay, so again, another very quiet, very subtle energy. Okay, but this person wants to take over your world. This person wants to win. I heard the worst kind. Someone from your past. Someone you grew up with. Someone you're close to person is studying you, waiting for the right time, Ace of Swords, to take over. What's the outcome? Six of Swords, okay? Your guides are going to extract this person, remove this person from your space, your world. You're moving to calmer waters, okay? This person is going to be very upset and feel left out because you're going to be celebrating, okay? <laughs> In the world card, okay? And you're going to be uh, traveling the world, seeing all over the world. There's something very significant with the six, uh, six of Wands. You're gonna be successful at whatever this is you're doing. And this person, it looks like they're gonna be looking out the window watching Okay, in their head about it because the Most High God is calling judgment on this person and extracting this person from your energy. Let's see. What advice do you have for our divine one? What is the advice? A win-win outcome is forecast. Six of Wands. Okay, you're going to win. What else? Look at the bigger picture. Okay, so this is your guys wanting you to pay closer attention to the people around you, okay? Listen closely to what they're saying or what they're not saying. More importantly, when it comes to this per particular person, this person's not saying a whole lot, but if you listen and look closely, you will, uh, you will know. You will be able to tap in and see what it is that they're doing, okay? step out of your comfort zone they're saying this because this, again this is somebody that you would not suspect to be doing this kind of thing behind the scenes operating in this way so they're wanting you to be a little bit more uncomfortable with your approach and how you welcome everyone into your space okay you appear to be a very loving and open and kind person that a lot of people gravitate towards so they're wanting you to Really pay closer attention to those around you and what's going on so that you can protect yourself from these types of energies. And also be sure that you're keeping up on your uh, spiritual cleansing practices at this time. I love you so very much. I really hope that you all enjoyed the read. If so, please like, share, comment, subscribe, and join the family.
I would love to have you. Ashe.